everyone, I'm Damien Holbrook with TV Guide Magazine and TV Insider, and I am sitting here with Beth Stern talking about the Kitten Bowl 7 on Hallmark this weekend. Beth, thank you so much for coming in. I Who's mean, our friend? Come on. Who's come this? On. Who's this little all star player? Well, he needs to be named, so what should we name him? Uh, I don't know. I, I, I like Tang. Tang's cute because Tang, he's, yeah. he's orange. He's right. He's a rescue from South Carolina, and Tang and his litter mates and so many more kittens are available this weekend at North Shore Animal League America, where we're holding our kitten parties in honor of Kitten Ball oh. 7. So how did you get involved in all of this? How lucky am I? All right. Yeah, I get to sit on a field with 100 adoptable kittens and let them frolic and play football all over me. Yeah, no, I think people know my husband and I are in animal rescue, mm. my husband Howard Stern, and we foster cats. I work very closely with North Shore Animal League America. So when Hallmark Channel contacted me and said, we have an idea for a show. Would you like to be involved? No brainer. <laughs> and, and like, pinch me. I yeah. don't even think this is a real phone call. So this is Kitten Ball 7. It's been uh. such a success. And when I mean success, I mean thousands and thousands and thousands of kittens and cats have been adopted because of the kitten and cat Which ball. Which is so great. Because yeah. the, so you have Kitten Ball on Sunday. On Sunday. On the day of the big game. But yeah. then you have Cat Ball. Yeah, that started before. last year. Mm -hmm. and we decided to showcase adults, seniors, and special needs cats that are sitting in shelters waiting for forever homes. Yeah. And we also follow their journeys, their rescue stories, and then we do some magical adoptions oh, on air. God, so right. it's really, it's a beautiful show. And this year you guys had a hundred kittens yeah. involved in Kitten Bowl. Yeah. Every and, year we've had over a hundred. And all of them were adopted out. They're all adopted. That's why we needed to rescue Hello, more for the party. You gotta get a forever home. <laughs> Look at his chunk I mean, face. Are we on. getting this How on camera? Not? This is like the chunkiest little love bug in the world. And look, he loves this. <sighs> He loves oh, he's, he's asleep. asleep. You're going to fall asleep. He's so cute. So what can people do if they want to get in touch with North Shore? Oh, well, they can log on to our website, mm -hmm. www.animalleague.org, and they can also see where we're holding kitten parties all over the United States and their adoption events, their specials, activities for children, and hundreds and hundreds of kittens that need forever homes. And please, let, let me show the little Siamese. Look at this little guy, too. Um, oh, yeah, so there's cute. so many animals this in need, and, oh, hello. and I always say definitely check out the seniors and the adults that need homes too. These guys stay little for like a blink, right, and that's it. Right. Then they become full size, and then those are the ones sitting in the cages at the yeah, shelters. So we need to really not overlook the adults. But you're going to be an adult, so you're right, going to need to be adopted. Wants, right. Everyone wants I mean, this is cutie, ridiculous. Right. Yeah. But then the grown-up cats, like, those are the ones that are going to be with you for, for a long time. Yeah, and a lot of times we get adults where family members have passed away or their human died or you know, it's horrible stories. And all they, they're they used to a family and a home and a bed, and they're the perfect, I always say even the dogs, too, the seniors, the adults, you don't need to go through that puppy training. Yeah, you know? yeah. yeah. Well, speaking of puppies, we have um, rough furries this year, so we have a, a lot. representation. We have a lot of puppies yeah. too. Oh no. Yeah. And how was that? Did they interact at all? You know what? We had them interact in the past, but I think they were in their separate area yeah. this year. Um, but they're so cute. And you foster so many. Yeah. So, what is your favorite thing about a cat? About a cat? Oh, geez. Um, I think it's all. Uh, we love all animals. I would foster anything at this point. My husband and I are like, there's a deer in the yard. He looks, he looks hurt. I'm like, we're hurrying him in. I work with wildlife rescue yeah. too, but cats are easy. They're, the people say, oh, cats are so independent and aloof. All six of our resident cats are like dogs. They sleep in bed with us. They greet us at the door. Right. They are, they're amazing. They have so personality. Until you have a cat in your life, then you will under you won't understand until you have one because they're really phenomenal. They're easy too. Yeah. I mean, they're, you don't have to wake up at six a.m. and take the cat out in this freezing oh, cold weather. Very true. Very true. And are are people still sh just shocked that Howard Stern is like a cat guy, like a like just an animal lover? At this point, we've been together twenty years, yeah. and I think he talks about cats yeah. daily. And he talked about our big expansion that we just spearheaded at North Shore yeah. Animal League America, Bianca's furry friends, cage free cat environment for all the cats waiting for the forever oh. homes so no at this point i don't think anybody's shocked yeah. that howard's a cat man <laughs> were you shocked that he turned out to be such a softie i don't think that i would have had a second date with howard stern had he not been a huge animal lover right, because right? that's my life and life. my passion and he was on board with me and he was an animal lover before he met me and um it's 
this one it's, now. Uh, you do such incredible work. Yeah. I look at these little guys and just think, oh, you're going to find forever homes. You're going to have great lives. And so much is because That's of what, what you're doing well, in Kitten Bowl and Hallmark. So I love working yeah. for North Shore Animal League America, the world's largest no-kill shelter. We do right. so many adoptions. Come visit us. We have our adoption center that's open this week, especially on Sunday because of oh, the nice. kitten bowl. Oh, so. nice. And, you know, it's, it's, it's a kitten party. Yeah, you, you gotta can't come. turn that down. <laughs> you can't. Excellent. Beth, thank you so much. You, you guys, don't forget, Kitten Bowl 7 on Hallmark this weekend. Yay.